Let's take a look at some of the output actions with inside of Mosaic Designer 2. The first one we'll take a look at is output serial. This is very similar to the input trigger for serial. What you're going to do is select which device will be outputting, either the local port on the MSC or a port on one of the RIOs, select which particular device if needed, and then type in a string. You can format that string in either ASCII, hex, or decimal. The contents of your string will be based around the requirements of whatever device you're sending to. Mosaic uses an open string format, which allows you to enter whatever you need. Taking a look at Ethernet, you'll notice it's very similar. The big difference we have in Ethernet is we actually have to specify an IP address and a port of where a message is going. We then choose a protocol, either UDP or TCP, and then we type in a string in the same method. Notice you always have your options for ASCII, hex, and decimal. For most UDP strings, though, you'll leave it at ASCII. Taking a look at MIDI, it's going to be the same as our input trigger. We hit Edit to open our MIDI message builder, select what type of message we want, and compose the message. For more information on all of these parameters, please take a look at the manual. Our last output action is output digital. This allows us to send a contact closure out from one of our remote devices. Select the device, either RIO44 or RIO08. Specify its number, choose an output, and select what the state will be.